Well, hey family, this is Darlene. Wanted to thank you for stopping by the Jury by BDK YouTube channel. I know you didn't come here for a sermon. <laughs> so here's the video and we'll talk soon. Hey family, this is Darlene. Happy Friday. Um, a couple of people were asking me about how I color wash um, my beads. Uh, some of these beads I will use sponges. And there is a certain type of technique that I use. And then there are times I will use a bowl. In this case, I want to take these beads that I've already color washed um, with some black. And I want to add a little gold to them because I want, um, I'm going to put gold. They're going to be black with some gold, um, a little bit of red, and then maybe some other color. Not really sure yet. I want to see how they're going to look with the, the black, the red, and the gold. And then if I want to add another color. Um, I will add another color, something like, oh my goodness, what were those beads that I used? Oh, shoot, where's that necklace at? I might have already said, no, I didn't. Hold on a second, let me see something. Okay. So the beads I'm going to do, I want a more like this type of, a bunch of little colors on it so I'm going to use just the black the gold and some red so I'm going to take my little paint I'm not going to put very much in here just and that might even be enough uh, maybe just a couple more dots here and there and then you can't do too much because if you do too much it'll literally just cover the cover the bead uh, let me make sure I got my little wire ready and then all I'm going to do is take the beads, drop the beads in, and then roll them around to the point where I want to see what I want to see. And that's about as much as I want to see on here. So I'm going to take them off, take them out. And I got my long wire. And you can see I don't want a whole lot on here. You can see that right there. It's just what I want. Not a lot. And then I'm going to put some, uh, I have to wrench the bowl out. And then I'm going to put some, some red paint. So, and this is basically what it looks like. So you can see. And then I'll do a little bit of red. Um, might put some other color in it too. Not really sure, but I'll test it out and see. And this is just enough. And you can see, you only want to put a couple of, couple of drops and I'll wrench all this out and then I'll put some red paint in this bowl and then I'll keep using this bowl. But this is what it looks like now. I'm going to let the paint dry and I only needed a couple because I want to make a certain type of bracelet for myself. Um, I got an event I'm going to this weekend, so I wanted to make a real special uh, type bracelet. So this is what this looks like. And when I finish the bracelet, I will come back and show you, you know, what it looks like so you can really get a look. But anyway, family, happy Friday. I hope everybody is being productive and having a really good time. And if you haven't joined the Jury by BDK Facebook group as of yet, uh, that creator zone, you might want to boogie on over there and uh, join the group. There's a lot of good resources up in there. There's a lot of good information regarding um, online platforms for Target, for Walmart, for Toomey, becoming a Toomey um, influencer. And somebody has said they don't have a website yet. I don't even think you need a website yet, especially if you're trying to build up your YouTube channel. Um, and if you buy product, I think it's pronounced Toomey, T-E-M-E, -E. no, 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 T-E-M-U. So if you buy from that website and you buy a lot of product from that website, you can possibly become an influencer on that website by the product that you buy from there. All you're doing is doing reviews on your YouTube channel. Like I think uh, Tamala does it. So that would be good for Tamala to do because I have seen you do a couple of uh, uh, review, not reviews, what do they call Reveals, like where you got your packages and you opened them up. So that would be like really good stuff to go on there and apply because you do have um, videos to show that you have done that before and you can become an influencer on there. And that too helps to build your channel. Um, I was watching some, 
I was watching some things the other day and I was also reading through some things and it was talking about YouTube and then how YouTube is really building up and then a couple of um, new stuff that's coming through YouTube and all this other type of stuff. And right now, you know what, YouTube, not only right now, but then the future is going to take the place of television. I don't care what anybody says at some point, because if you think about the generations now, they're not sitting around watching television. Everything is on their phones. They're literally watching everything on their phones, on their tablets, um, their laptops. They're not sitting in front of televisions like older people. So you have the last gener the older generations that are watching television, but then you have the generations after the older generations, they're literally consuming all their content by phone, um, on YouTube, on TikTok, on all these other platforms outside of television. So why do you think all these platforms are coming up with different type of programming like movies and uh, shows and all these different type of things? Because they're understanding the direction in which everything is going. You know what? This paint is probably already dry, folks. But anyway, I got to go and um, I will talk to y'all later.